Hi everybody from the Fox and Weather Center. It's your old pal Ian Leonard and I'll tell you what if you could possibly cram any more into the forecast over the next four days. I don't know how, but it all starts with big changes blowing in. Friday's forecast is all about wind. Wind that warms us up and equally cools us down all in about 12 hours. Then Saturday we're cool, Sunday we're warm, and next week we'll talk about snow chances. Now let's talk about future temperatures. This starts Friday morning at 7 a.m. As we wake up tomorrow morning and from midnight forward tonight, Temperatures begin to go up so that we're at around seven degrees at this point here on a Thursday night. Friday morning we wake up at 10 and then watch this surge of warm air that comes in out of the west takes us up into the low 30s. That's about 1 30 or 2 o'clock in the afternoon as quickly as we warm with a strong wind. Watch the cold air roll across the region into tomorrow night so that temperatures drop down into the teens by dinner and into the single digits as we head into Friday night. And I mentioned winds. Watch this where you see the white lines. We call those streamlines the wind direction. These aren't temperatures. These are future wind gusts tomorrow at 130 40 to 50 miles per hour, 50 to 60 miles per hour from Hinkley all the way back to Detroit Lakes in the Metro. We're talking 20 to 40 miles per hour, but keep watching wind strong out of the northwest. This is where we cool things down and look at your wind gusts. 40 to 50 mile per hour potential that stay very strong all the way into late night Friday night. So when you put this together in your seven day forecast, we'll start warm, warm to 33 degrees just past the noon hour on Friday, and then the temperatures cool with that very strong wind to wind advisory out for a good portion of the Fox 9 viewing area. Cooler on Saturday, warmer in a big way on Sunday. And as we look toward early next week, we pick up a chance of shovelable snow. So if you're a fan of snow and snow sports, or if you work in on or around snow, I think you're going to like the forecast early next week.